Thanks for joining us tonight. A beloved Madison restaurant on the Isthmus will soon close its doors after decades of memories. The next restaurant and lounge is a Greek American diner on State Street, two blocks from the Capitol. Arman Rahman looks back on its iconic history with the community that has made it home. Stepping into the doors of Nick's restaurant on State Street, you're transported to the 60s, the heyday of this supper club. And for many, memories will be all that remain come May 11th. When it's time, it's time. While it's time may be up, time endlessly wraps around all of Nick's restaurant. The unique bar patterns. We got the old goose and the old light. It still has that charm and you still have the same people, same guy behind the bar. and. Yeah, it's just comfortable. Nick and Serena Christakos opened their doors on May 16, 1959, and Dino Christ's father became a partner two years later. Dino and his brother took over the business in the 1990s. But recently, Dino says the restaurant's been through some hard times, like the COVID-19 pandemic, short staffing, and inflation. So it just got to be the point where I'd wake up and go to my phone and go, okay, what problems do I have to solve today? As opposed to where I used to wake up and go, can't wait to get to work and see my friends. We're losing another medicine institution. It became a staple for many customers like John Dillette. Grew up in Middleton, but we used to come down here and then all through college, 80s and 90s. We came here a lot, yeah. And then come here now with the family. And Dino has seen some pretty famous faces come through in his time here. Robin Williams was in here and partied one night. Lenny Kravis was in here jamming by himself with his band and nobody knew who he was. Server Stella Buckley needed a job while she was in school three years ago. For her, Nix was in the right place at the right time. And without any waitressing experience or bartending experience, Dino and Tom hired me immediately. I really felt community with the people that I worked with. They look out for me for anything. Dino says what he'll miss most is the time spent with the people. Everyone's asking me what I'm taking, and honestly, it's the memories. Nix will be open for a half day on May 11th. The first half for the public and customers to come in and say, their goodbyes and the second half a private party for friends and family and employees reporting on state street armand raman news three now